uh, before we do anything else, actually, before we go to the boss, I just want to check down here. Ah, uh, yes. Here I come. Oh, yes, of course, I remember that now. <laughs> what was I thinking? Uh, well, we should get around to exploring that little area at some point. Anyway, onward! I've been waiting for you, Kuna. Harold! What are you doing here? Good question. I've come to kill you, for Daenerys. But why? Ugh, this isn't the time for bad jokes, or haven't you noticed? The only joke here is your ridiculously oversized pancake face. Oh, you did not just say that. Try looking in the mirror at your own face, you tattooed mess of squigglies! Hmm. Harold! Why must we be forced to fight one another? Why even ask? Accept your fate as I have mine. Can't you see? I've been turned into this hideous monster. That was your choice. A monster. With no other purpose than to kill those who stand in the way of Daenerys' plans. You don't want to do that. No! Daenerys is deceiving you! You will always be you regardless of what anyone else says, Harold. Search your heart, you know it to be true. Enough! Your time to die has come. Harold! I'll cut you uh, down! This is going Cha! to be bad. Uh, oh. oh, ow. Can't run properly. Uh, uh, ow. Ow. Uh -huh. Oh, uh, sorry, that was a misstep on my part. Uh, oh. You have quite a lot of projectiles there. Uh. Ow! In my delicious fruit salad. Ah. Hey, come on. You must surrender at some point, Harold. You can't keep this up forever. Oh man, there goes our magic. Gonna have to finish this by hand. Far to the right. Come on. You made us do that, Harold. Harold. Uh, th thank you, Kuna. Long have I been s searching for someone who could end my life. We're not going to end your life, it's just a yo-yo. Then, as fate would have it, I ran into you. How I've longed for this day when I could finally stop killing. Don't you have any will of your own? What is this, Howell? I order you to get rid of them, and here I find you indulging in sob stories? Daenerys! And... Brood. My dear Harold, you are weak because your emotions control you. I knew I should have killed you for deserting me. But here we are, and in any case, I've no need of one who cannot fulfill their purpose. Suffer there, and die in agony. Daenerys, you're... You're a monster! Yes, well said. Me? A <laughs> monster? <laughs> oh, I could do it much better than that. Maybe. But you're only laughing because you know it to be true. Such a foolish boy. 
thinking that you can so easily separate good from evil, when that is exactly what breeds it. Now look at yourself. Master Daenerys, let us not waste our precious time explaining to these brats what they cannot understand. The girl with angel wings is now in our possession, and all that is left is to find a way to extract her power. Then my physical body will be restored to what it wants. No. Restored with far more power than before. Hmm. Precisely. Though we should return to the temple before the outside air causes harm to your present body. <laughs> Weakness to air, eh? Indeed. Our work here has been fruitful. If you children wish to face me, come to the Minato Temple. I'll be waiting. Count on it. <laughs> Riel, no. Let them go. We need to attend to Harold's wounds first. And I don't see Balboa anywhere. Mm, don't see anyone anywhere. That big womanizer. Like he's going to die anytime soon. Though I hope the same for Leone and Euro as well. Hmm. Can't let them die. Since we didn't see any of them, they must still be alive. At any rate, let's hurry and get Harold home. Mm-hmm. In our bed again. Do you think Harold's all right, Kuna? He still hasn't regained consciousness. And aside from his injuries, he appears to have suffered some serious trauma. That we may have gave him. In any case, I'm sure it'd be best to enlist Kloon's help, given that he's both a doctor and Harold's brother. Yes, just like old times, eh? Agreed. Why don't we go talk to him and see if we can convince him to come here? Yes. Let's go. Quickly. Hmm. Yes. Yes. Let's go. Oh, Florin! What? What's the matter, Kuna? Why are you so flustered? Actually, Harold's been injured, so we were just going to see Clune. But we can't leave him alone in his condition. Hmm. If it wouldn't be too much of a burden, would you mind watching over Harold until we get back? Sure. If it will help. I really appreciate this, Florin. We'll be back as soon as we can. <laughs> Excellent. She's dependable. Now, any mail? Oh, postcard. Yeah, and check out the hot spring. What I wouldn't give to relax in a place like that. Who's it from, by the way? It looks like Libra, Rufia, and Puria. Those three sisters from before. Let's see what they have to say in the next part. <laughs>